How's it going guys? This is TechWare Tactical back with something even more fun. This is the second video with the new microphone, 60 sub special. We upgraded the equipment a little bit. Go back and look on the channel. I'll try and link it down below since I'm somewhat getting good at this. So this is uh, the Yeti Works CZ Scorpion Evo 3 mag pouch. This is probably the first true quality piece that I ever got. I love my CZ. It's meant to carry four of the 30 round mags. The one that's all the way on the right is a little stumpy one. That's one of the ones that comes with the CZ. I have been using this thing and for some reason, and I hate to start it with a criticism, these things are still beyond tight. Ooh. They're starting to loosen up a little bit, but my God, I mean, I, they, they did a good job of making sure those things are not going to come out anytime soon. Nothing. It's meant to go on a plate carrier, or they also send a strap that I've taken off since that you can rock as a shoulder mount or as a belly band. I don't know why you would rock a belly band that way, but hey, you do you. It does indeed have built-in panels, so you can attach this directly. I prefer these over the old-school molly straps. I just do. It's so much easier, especially with everyone that's now moving into more laser-cut molly systems. It's just so much easier when you have a thin piece of plastic that can handle the same amount of abuse but keep it just as secure i really appreciate that so i can't remember exactly what i paid for this it was a it was a substantial amount especially for a mag pouch but again you're paying for quality and i even waited so i could get it in my favorite pattern and i i'm i'm still really happy with it there really isn't anything negative I can say about it, aside from the fact that it seems to always be out of stock. I think I waited probably about six to eight months before I could actually get this in Cryptek Typhoon. It's, it's my favorite pattern. Yes, I know it's a little cringy. No, I don't really care. I like it. I'm going to keep using it. I'm going to keep buying it. I wish that... I really wish that more companies made more gear in that pattern. I, it, generally the ones that do are horrendously expensive and I generally can't afford it so this was kind of like a happy medium where it's a reputable known company uh, they do a lot of CZ Scorpion modifications uh, not just the carriers and things like that they also do uh, grips stocks stock uh, assist, uh, accessories um, they do upgraded uh, magazine releases they do all sorts of stuff on there and that's Yeti Works. Now they aren't a sponsor. I have no sponsors. The only sponsor I have is my bank account. I've said this before. I'm bought by nobody. And right now, I'm kind of happy about that because it means that I can poke holes in whatever I damn well please. I just like that right now. And I know that that, that word that I just said a little bit ago might get me demonetized later on, but that's something to deal with later on down the line. Right now, I'm still starting out Last time I checked, we were at 66 subs, so like, comment, subscribe, do that if that's what you want. I'm not going to force you to do it. Can't force you to do it. I want to still be able to make content for you guys. I just said earlier in the video, I just upgraded the microphone. Every time we start hitting little goals, I try to upgrade the equipment. First time, it was moving from a terrible little freebie tripod that I had up to a nice tripod, a nice er tripod anyway. Uh, the last one was uh, upgrading the microphone, which you're hearing me through now. That video unboxing is also back on the channel. I think it's one or two videos. Two, because I also put the demo test out of me actually using it for the first time. So go back and look at that if you want. I, I'm not going to start linking all these videos to it. If you want to go back and watch it, go for it. So right now, I, I can't really do much but sing its graces. If I really had to nitpick, it would still be that the retention is too tight. 
you would really have to play around with it in order for it to loosen up and that's not uncommon especially with equipment like this it is a little bit of a pain though I've had these stuffed in there for ooh, probably about a year and it's just getting to the point where it is loose enough for it to be comfortable and not jammed in there also I really wish that these were removable but it is what it is you know they can be tucked behind it you can make those disappear it's not a huge problem and if something weird does happen to your chest rig or your plate carrier well you could always in theory take this off and use it as a bandolier where if you clip those off you won't be able to at all so it's the kind of the best way to just keep your options open with it and I still really like it so thank you so much guys I'll see you in the next one Drop down in the comments if you like Yeti Works. If you like their stuff, you know, go for it. Tell me how the audio sounds. Give me some feedback on it. I really want to hear because to me, I can tell the difference. But I don't know if you guys can. So just go ahead and shout in the comments. Thank you so much, guys. And I'll see you on the next one.